can't believe we finally doing this. I'm still afraid. Are you afraid? I don't understand them. Ahmed, what if they catch us? I'll tell God it was your fault. Pick up your pace. Come on. Fisherman begins at 3 in the morning. Other team members join at the pier where they quickly load rations for cooking fish on board. Shortly after 3, they head out for their fishing grounds, which takes about an hour or two, depending upon the nature of the catch. Together they deploy the nets and then wait until noon. Meanwhile they keep themselves busy with little chores on board. By midday fishermen begin hauling in the nets and sort out the catch. For local fishermen of Karachi, Buddu and Bundal serve as an offshore landing ground. The seasonal visiting fishermen, there is also one family of permanent residents on the Bundal island. Baba Adam and his wife Rahimi, who both claim to be centenarians. However, Rahimi Bibi seems to be in late 80s, living in abject poverty with her sons and grandchildren. The old couple rarely venture so far as Ibrahim Hadri. And it was one of the unusual days. Baba Adam had been taken to a hospital in Ibrahim Hadri. <laughs> In October 2006, the elderly people came to know that their home island had been sold to a company in Dubai.
This is indeed a vital question. without my cell phone. I think uh, I may not be able to survive a single second without my cell phone. See, my phone is always with me. I can only survive for one or two hours without my cell phone. It's the teen's new best friend. It's like my friend. I keep it with me all the time. I sleep with it. I put it under my pillow. Or is it? I think it is more like a drug addiction. Yeah, I'm, I am addicted to it. With an estimated 75% of young people having one, no teenager wants to be left out. With the cell phone usage growing rapidly among teens, dependence on social relations is being replaced by dependence on the cell phones. So much so that the teens with low self-esteem mistake the phone for the person. Farhan Jamalvi, Dawn News, Karachi. Looking for Obama in Layari is not that difficult. Asghar Ali, like many other black people of African origin, are unanimously hopeful of a better future. President Obama may not have a direct impact on the Baloch community, but the induction of the first black president into the White House has convinced the black people in Layari that change is possible. Farhan Jamalvi, Dawn News, Karachi. But wait until I go on, man, you know, I'm having fun. I'm going to have a blast on stage. It's Jersey B. Barish ho aur nahaya na jaye, yeh kaise ho sakta hai? Lekin bin barsaad ki barish mein nahana aur apne favorite gulukars ke gaano par raks karre ka bhi apna hi alahda maza hota hai. Cameraman, Shahram Shahzad ke saath, Farhan Ahmad Jamalvi, Gio, Dubai.